A bag has 8 blue marbles and 7 yellow marbles. A marble is taken out at random and not replaced. Another marble is then taken out. Find the probability that the marbles are different colors. So what we have here is one event happening and then another one following it. In other words, a successive event. And whenever you've got successive events, the best thing to do to find the probability is to use tree diagrams. So let's start drawing you. So for our first event, we can either pick a blue marble or a yellow marble. The total number of marbles at the start is 8 plus 7, 15. And we know that there are 8 blues or 7 yellows. Now, the second event, we can still pick a blue or a yellow marble. But now we're told that the marble is not replaced. So now the total number of marbles is 14 in the bag. If we go along the branches, if we select a blue in the first tie, there will be seven blues left, but there will be seven yellows. So you can check seven plus seven is equal to 14. The fractions should add up on their set of branches. So now if we pick a yellow the first time, there's still eight blues. So eight fourteens is blue, but now instead of seven yellows, there are six. Eight plus six is 14. So now we've drawn our tree. We want to find the probability that they're different and we can do this by finding blue then y or y then b. So probability of blue and yellow plus the probability of yellow and blue. And these are two different ways of getting different marbles. So you have to add them. So if you're going across the branches, you multiply. So blue and yellow is 8 fifteenths times 7 fourteenths. And if you're just adding separate branches together, you have to put plus. And then 7 fifteenths times by 8 fourteenths. Both of these give us 4 fifteenths. So now if we add these events, we get the probability of 8 fifteenths. And that is the probability that the marbles are different colors.